was a big day for our community, but especially for 22 men and women who put on the badge and became officers today. John Potter reports on the proud moments at the Law Enforcement Academy graduation ceremony. The words they all waited for were these. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm pleased to present the graduating class of 2019-01. It was a packed house to salute and cheer 22 men and women. Each has shown they have what it takes to wear the badge for five local law enforcement agencies. Even though we all may wear a different uniform, at the end of the day, we serve this great community. To get to this point, the recruits completed more than 800 hours of intensive training. Proud families, friends, and future co-workers here to celebrate their big accomplishment. A big room full of smiles. Tomorrow. <laughs> Tomorrow's my first day. Start right off. <laughs> it's going to be good. I'm excited. My mom's a little apprehensive and nervous because, you know, I'm her baby girl, but uh, she's very excited. The average changes, but this year, eight out of 10 who signed up made it to this moment after 22 weeks of grueling physical and mental training. Today, celebration. You know, it's that excitement of that new job, that new career, that new chapter, like we all told them when we spoke to them. Cassandra Jacobson is one of them. Her career began with her childhood best friend, whose dad was a cop. I always had so much respect for him, and so being able to do this myself, it's, it's, it's really an amazing feeling. As one of our newest officers told me today, this means the world. For Officer Horn, she believes it's her destiny. This means a lot. It's life changing. I'm here now to help save and change lives. So this is what I was meant to do. Happy day. You're still standing at attention. Uh, it's at like, ease. <laughs> it's just habit at this point. Covering the story, John Potter, 2 News. Uh, congrats to them. And of the 22 graduates, nine report to the Reno Police Department, six to Washoe County Sheriff's Office, three for the Sparks Police Department, three for UNR Police Services, and one with Washoe County Juvenile Probation.